Hello everyone, let's check out the Witcher 3 config files. Make sure you have the backup files before you start tweaking these. Here you can see the path for the config files. Ok, so here we have the post processing config file for the game. And here are the presets for it. So post processing low, medium and high. And the low doesn't load up that much effects like you can see here but the high setting actually loads up all the effects like sharpen filter depth of fear or blur or anything like that but you can actually disable this if you want like depth of fear or blur if you don't like them just type false here but there's also a ambient occlusion setting which is which is here it's the ssao solution which is val value by one and it shows up here there's HPAO ambient occlusion so if you change value 2 here it actually loads up the HPAO value in the game so I, I think I'm going to test this first in the game when I can play it and later on some other stuff so this config file is called by name rendering and the presets are here low medium high and uber which is the ultra setting and it shows up the highest values like three and the header works is true so it's like that and here we have the shadow settings and uber settings are here for the shadows you can maybe tweak this i don't know yet next one is the terrain settings and this is a little different because low setting has higher values and the uber or the ultra has lower settings so you need to lower these if you want to make them better next one is the water quality and this is actually the tessellation factor for the ocean and here is the uber it's 64 and the low is 8 so maybe it's sound picking also here and now we get to the grass density this looks really nice maybe if this works but yeah you can maybe increase these values too next one is the texture options so here we have the low preset and it loads up these texture sizes but it also downscales them by 2 and the uber or the ultra setting is here and you can see game only has 2k textures there's no 4k textures in this game yet and it doesn't downscale anything of course and here's the texture memory budget so maybe this will help if you have lots of memory in your GPU so you can actually increase these values maybe and foliage visibility is here low set preset is 4, uber is 24 and here is the level of detail and it's actually deagle's height distance and the low setting is 15 and the uber is 80 so maybe some tweaking here and that's about it here we have the next config file which is called pi community and it has some npc settings like max spawn npc limit which is 300 and spawn radius and t spawn radius so this could be interesting if these work and here is the final config file and it's called rendering again but there's some different settings like uber sampling which is anti-aliasing and it requires a lot of hardware but there's also msaaa level which is the anti-aliasing quality level and you can adjust the level from here but not from the game or that's what i heard but you can just make a change here if you want also not sure you can just enable msaa from here just 
by typing true here, but you can try it. So thanks for watching and I hope this helps you with the config files.